Hi YouTube, this is Diva One coming to you with some more wealth information. Um, I have three things and hope they will help you. Um, number one, there is what's called Uber. And I'm quite sure you have heard about Uber. Um, and I'll put some more description under the bottom or information under the bottom in the description. But Uber is a good company. There have been some incidents because you know in any company, sometimes you get a nut in the company and they mess it up for everybody else. But Uber is a very good company. What people don't realize is that as long as you've got a good driver's license and no more than I think it's like two points, Uber will actually help you buy a car to use for their business and you are I believe an independent contractor um, Uber actually is start starting now the driverless car but I think they'll have an attendant in it but they don't have to drive it but that's a whole nother story they're talking about getting flying cars I don't want that either but long story short try Uber and see how you like that. If you don't have a car, as long as you got a license, Uber will help you get a car. Also, there are two companies. One is Logisticare, and the other one is Southeast Transportation. I don't know if you know what a what Medicaid transportation is, but it's for patients who are on Medicaid, and um, that can be anyone from an infant all the way to somebody from 125. If they've got Medicaid, not Medicare now, but Medicaid, then there is what's called Medicaid transportation. One is Logisticare, and the other one is Southeast Transportation. Um, they both pay very well. You are a independent contractor, and um, my advice, because I have talked to a couple of people who do this type of work. My advice to is to become a volunteer with them because um, when you become a volunteer, you actually make more. If you don't want to be an owner of a company, some people like to be an owner. Um, then they buy vans and they keep them up and they hire drivers to drive the van those people get paid 300 and some odd dollars per trip but then you got the maintenance and upkeep of a van and that can become expensive after a while but uh, with with both companies also if you become a volunteer not just a driver for a company who is contracted under them because then you won't make but fifty dollars a trip and that's not a lot when you've got to go on a two and a half hour trip and you're making, what, $50? That's not good. Anyway, um, and you got to come out your pocket too doing that. Doing it that way, you got to come out your pocket to gas. Yes, you're reimbursed for the gas, but still, you got to have money up front to do that. But with Logisticare and Southeast Transportation, with both of them, if you're a volunteer, you can make, oh my God, a whole lot of money per day. People say, well, I thought you said volunteer. Well, you are a volunteer driver, but you're also an independent contractor. And Logisticare and Southeast will pay you for taking a patient to a hospital, to um, some kids, you know, to the special homes that they're in. Um, and don't worry, those particular kind of kids, the parents have to go and you bring the parents back. So, in other words, when you take people somewhere, that's a round trip. Say someone wants to take someone to um, UVA in Charlottesville, Virginia. From, okay, let's put it this way. From where I am to UVA is two and a half hours. That would be for them um, four hours. And what happens is that when they do the four hours, that's it. But guess what? They've made over $192 um, for that day. And 
Then they do the same thing the next day, and the next day, say you do it five days a week. That's good money. Count up 192 plus five, and then um, take that times four, and that would be your salary for that month. And if you go somewhere longer, say someone wanted to go from North Carolina to D.C., and by the way, Logistic Care at Southeast is all over the United States. There is another company, but I can't seem to find out who they are. But long story short, the longer the trip, the more money you make. And all you're doing is driving. And usually, well, people have to have somebody along with them. So you're not alone. And um, you just drive them there. You wait for them. And, you know, doctor's appointments are usually anywhere from, what, an hour to two, to two hours. Sometimes more, but if it's more, then they are allowed to go on another trip and they will, the logistic here at least will send somebody else for you. But you never are without a ride. Um, but that's a good thing. So if you're looking for a way to make more money, try either logistic care or Southeast. And I'll leave the links under the bottom of this video. And um, like subscribe comment if you wish i wish oh i sound so southern don't i wish <laughs> but whatever you want to do i thank you i love you jesus is lord don't forget to check out my blog the link will be under this video bye bye remember jesus is lord